Chris Jones, VP of Government Relations and Council here at NGA. I'm here standing outside the Capitol because we're hearing Democratic leadership is going to schedule a vote on the Raise the Wage Act, a bill that would increase the federal minimum wage to $15 an hour by the year 2024 and eliminate the youth training wage. Although it's well-intentioned, uh, we have significant concerns about the bill. In particular, it creates an unlevel playing field against small businesses versus large businesses that are able uh, to have the access to capital and the profit margins that can afford a $15 wage. Uh, we're also concerned about um, independent small businesses that operate in low cost of living areas, in particular um, food desert areas that have low, ac low access um, to healthy and affordable food. Uh, we're worried that this may inhibit grocers from investing in these communities. Um, also, uh, many young people, their first job is at a grocery store. We're worried that by eliminating the youth and the training wage, this will have a significant impact on young people getting jobs at grocery stores. Uh, if you're opposed to the $15 minimum wage in your store, please visit www.grocerstakeaction.org and click on $15 minimum wage to let your member of Congress know that you oppose the Raise the Wage Act. Also, for more updates on this issue and others, please stay tuned to Capitol Checkout and Express Lane. Thank you.